Good day gamers, Matt in the Hat here, and thank you so much for stopping by. Today we are once again back on Pokemon Shining Pearl to continue our adventure. When we left off last time, we had just entered Jubilee City. I forget how bright my light is when I first turn it on. I don't think there's much else to do other than uh, continue our progress through the city and on to the next town, I guess. Oh, you're a Pokemon trainer? But you don't have a Pokétech yet. Pokétech is short for Pokemon Watch. Oh my, you are a rare case indeed. You see, I invented a now manufacturer Poke Tech Pokétection. Not only that, I am now conducting the Pokétech promotional campaign. All you have to do is find three clowns in Jubilee City. If you can find them, I'll give you your very own Pokédex. Interesting. So we shall have a gander for some clowns, I suppose. Oh, I'm sorry. It's not ready yet. The GWS? Wasn't that the Global Trade Center back in the day? Oh, here we go, here's a clown. Hi, I'm a Pokétech campaign clown. Let's roll out my question. Does a Pokémon grow by defeating other Pokémon and gaining XP points? It sure does, my dude. Ding dong. Ding ding. You are absolutely correct. Pokemon grow stronger by defeating other Pokemon in battle. Some Pokemon can even change into different Pokemon through the process known as evolution. There we go. There's Coupon 1 for us. I have to go find some more clowns. Uh, well, there's another one. Excuse me, sir. Hi, I'm a Pokédex campaign clown. Let's roll out my question. Can Pokémon hold items? Yeah, I'm sure they can. A Pokemon may hold a single item. Some items become effective as soon as they are held by a Pokemon. Berries are eaten by Pokemon as necessary during battle. Here you go. Here's another coupon. We've got coupon number three. And there's the last clap. Last clown, last clown, last clown. There we go. Ah. Just like Pokemon, do the moves of Pokemon also have types? Yes, sir, they do. If a Pokemon's type matches the type of a move it uses, that move is made more powerful. And I've been playing Pokemon for... I suppose 13 years and I didn't know that. <laughs> I did not know that at all. I suppose... No, is it 13 years? However long ago Platinum came out, that's when I played it. That's when I first played Pokemon game. And I just use the direct <laughs> and I just restrict my analog stick because it's not very uh... But yeah nice. We got ourselves the Pokewatch thing. 
Press the R button to try it out. Ooh, this is weird. What tools have we got then? A calculator, steps, a team, and that's it. And that takes up the corner of our screen. Cool. Well, what else can we do here then? Suppose this, uh, building is the I suppose we'll go to a barony. Oh, of course I got tougher. <laughs> Who do you take me for? Of course. Of course, of course. Of course you got tougher, guys. Ah, but two Pokemon. <laughs> They are a tad bit close to the level of our uh, Muffy's Law. Ooh, sick critical hit. Don't get cocky, kid. This isn't over. <laughs> ah, dear. They're getting cocky, they're getting sloppy. Perhaps one of my uh, favourite voice lines from Apex. Oh, I suppose if his style is level 7, his Piplup's probably level 9 as well. But I don't think that'll be much difference because we have type advantage. Oh, Sparky Land Thunder Shock, that's good. That will come in handy. Hey, it's got Chimchar, not Piplup. I'm an idiot. Uh, oh, if we uh, didn't say anything about type advantages. Slowly but surely, whittle it down with tackle. I mean, I suppose maybe using Leap Edge is probably. probably might do some more damage than what tackle does. Nah, it did bugger all extra damage. Growth increases attack, doesn't it? Special attack boost too. Good job I bought those extra potions. Uh, but Scratch is still doing more damage than I'd like. Had a bit tight. Ah. Hope the brawl doesn't take too long to learn a war type. And then 
saying that, it would be nice. It would be nice if we got our hands on a shoulder. Even though the steel pipe in it will have disadvantage against this chain. His ground and rock type moves would be super helpful. But there we go. He is beaten. Uh, Pokemon have leveled up a bit more. Oh, what just happened? I lost. Damn right you did, son. Wah! What do you mean I lost? Well, that's it. That's the last time I'll ever lose. I'm going to be the world's toughest trainer, and you know it. The first thing to do is take down the Urber or or the gym. I don't know how it's pronounced. Orbra? Is it Orbra? Orbra? I don't know. I don't have a clue. But, I guess that'll do for this episode. I suppose it's a bit of a short one. But, it's not really a great deal to do for, I guess. But, there we go. We got ourselves the Poke Watch in the corner there. And we made our way through. Well, I suppose it's not really a great deal to Jubilee City, but we had a fight against our rival. But stay tuned next week as we continue further into the game and uh, probably get ourselves our first gym badge. Whether it will be in the next video or the one after. But, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And as always, thanks for watching.